Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm some Lunacy and today we're continuing with the Not So Berry Challenge. Okay, so last episode we aged up Eva um, and got to know Aldo quite well, should I say. Uh, the oh, Wow, why is everybody gathering around here? Oh yeah, Curtis is home from work but he's rather stinky so we're just going to get him to take a shower. Did I just see Charlie run past the house? I think I did. Okay, so we still have Emerson at school at the moment. Um, now, also last episode, I was... Eva, you're, you need some food. Do you want to come? Oh, there's the cake from Aldo still. Uh, grab some leftovers. There are no leftovers. Okay, um, serve some lunch. We'll just do some BLTs, that's nice and easy. Get rid of that. Okay, now, oh my gosh, I never noticed that that easel was stuck halfway in the wall. Um, and we'll just put it there, I guess. No? Maybe, maybe over here. There. Okay. Who is that? Oh, it's Curtis. <laughs> I haven't seen that outfit before. Interesting. Right, speaking of Curtis, you need to work on your fitness, I believe. Uh, yep, for your job. Level 10. Can we mentor? Because we got the... We got the thingy... I can't... How do we do it again? Mental fitness. Discuss work. I don't know. Um... He just wants to whisper seductively and share secrets. <laughs> Maybe it's under actions? No. Friendly? I don't... We we'll just discuss fitness techniques. I don't know how to mentor and it doesn't give you the thing how to do it. Did you call Tamil? Where's Aldo? Is he still here? Right. Yes, he is. Good. How's he feeling? Do you want to call Tamil? Right, now, we haven't got Eva in a career yet. She does need to do food. Uh, medical and then entertainment. Um, so everyone's eating. Aldo's left, that's fine. Oh, Emerson's back from school. Where is he? Oh, he's asleep. Poor little bugger. He's tuckered out. Okay. Griselda, you need to do parenting skill. So, oh, the humor and hijinks festivals in town. There's too much to think about. Um, let's discuss work. Uh, Give parenting tips. Um, brain. Okay, right. 
We have to live in three different towns with Grisel, uh, with Eva. So, one of the things I was debating and not quite sure on how to do it was one of my mini goals was to have all of the past generations have their ghosts. And we often get visits from all of the people. Uh, do we? I think we need to tether. No, we don't. Okay. Um, that was one of the butlers. I'm trying to think of too many things. Okay, so one of the suggestions was that we have apartments, which I thought was a brilliant idea. And that was suggested by Sweetie Pie. Um, because I had gone into San Myshuno and built a whole new house for Eva and everybody. Uh, but then we got the suggestion that they have separate apartments. So what I'm going to do is just quickly show you what I've ended up with. Okay, so this is what we've ended up with. As you can see, it is two separate houses on the same lot. Now one of these will be for Eva and one will be for the rest of the family. I have created a space for Ahana. I don't know if she'll be coming with us though but I've built it just in case and it is in San Myshuno and we are right opposite. Um, I built it on the lot where the waterside warble used to be, so the karaoke bar and it just so happens I found out that Aldo, our current love interest, lives right next door. So that will be nice and handy. We'll probably see him around a bit but we're not moving in just yet. So we'll head back to a regular household. Okay, so we're back at the regular house. Now, um, I had actually built the house before I had the suggestion, but it was quite easy just to sort of split it into two, if that makes sense. But yeah, I loved that suggestion. And I have allowed space for the morning room. I pretty much just copied and pasted it. Um, same, you'll see a lot of the rooms are exactly the same because I tell you, copy paste really helped a lot. Um, so although they're going to be moving, it will feel like the same house, kind of, if that makes sense. I'm really excited. Okay, there is quite a few things I did forget though, and I'm sure we'll add them, discover what they are and add them as we play the game. Now, speaking of which, we better get on because we have a lot of skills that Eva needs to master. Um, actually, what, I, what do you know what I should do? Maybe we should have everybody move out now. You know, it's Monday evening. Um, we'll just get some prized possessions. I don't know if this photo is going to be counted. I'm just going to move the urns. I'm pretty sure everything else copied over. Give them to Eva because it's her house that holds the morning room. Oh my gosh. I hope I'm going to be able to have everybody labelled. Ah, okay, I think that's everybody. Anything else that we need? Um, I think the photo, Griselda's things in her bed, whoa, 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 where's her bedroom? There it is. Okay, Griselda's things, photo of her sister, her trophies. Ah. Uh, how do we put that in our inventory? I think we have to go to build mode. Um, Curtis's books. Anything of Emerson's. His television. Or did that move over? It may have moved over, but I'll grab it just in case. Uh, is there anything of Eva's that she needs? 
I don't think so. Okay, I think we're good to go. Right. So I think we'll have Eva by the house. Uh, how do we do it? How do we buy a new house? Is it on the computer? Move household. Confirm. Uh, we want it furnished. We don't want to keep our furniture. Oh, is that going to sell the urns? It shouldn't do because they're in our inventory. Ta-da! So we're here. Okay, now. This is where Griselda, Curtis and Emerson are going to live. Um, probably should warn you if you don't like custom content, look away because it is full of custom content. Okay, so we need to claim this bed. Claim this bed. Emerson, claim this bed. And Griselda, if you could assign bed to Ahana. And it looks like she did come with us. Uh, we should also put the walls up and lock door for everyone but the butler. Okay, right. And now over to Griselda's house. Oh, she's having a quick sneak peek. Uh, there's the morning room. Everybody's going to want to hang out in each other's houses. It's the only thing. Claim that bed. Um, okay, now let's have a quick tour. So, <laughs> we have, this is Griselda's house. So we have the entrance, a little area to sit in. Charlie, want to hang out? No. Actually, I do. Do you want to come over? And where is Benson? Come over and check out the new house. Okay, Griselda's house. We have the front living room. Oh, no, I accidentally left that. That shouldn't be there. Why is that there? I'll move it later. Okay, so we have the living room. Spot to watch the neighbours. Like That's got a great view of the park across the road. Uh, then we can come into the dining room. and the kitchen and here we have the morning room so we should probably put all of the urns back okay inventory where are the pet urns here we go so we have crystal she's the papa and george george goes up here Crystal goes up here and we have starting at the beginning oh my gosh sorry okay pepper Jared now I saw Aurora where is she Aurora 
and Rex. Then we have, oh my, ah, Luna and Jeffrey, and of course, who can forget a butler for a day? Rainash. Okay. Done. Excellent. Now, rest of the tour. Kitchen. Leads to the morning room. Leads to this little open garden area. Need to put the walls down. It's not working. Why can't I look in? The little morning area, breakfast nook, place to have a coffee. In here is a big empty space. And the reason there's a big empty space is because originally, in the original house, this was Curtis's gym. However, Eva doesn't need a gym, so I just deleted the furniture and I thought perhaps with her careers she might get some objects and things that she needs, especially the medical career. Uh, upstairs we have a little landing, reading area. Eva's exact same bedroom and bathroom. We have a little study area here. Guest bedroom and bathroom, quite simple. And over to Griselda's house. We have Griselda and Curtis's exact same bedroom, sort of, just different colours. Um, the same bathroom, we have a harness room with the bathroom and we have Emerson's exact bedroom and it looks like his television did move over. Um, and a little computer study area. I haven't completely finished decorating. Obviously there's blank walls and a spot for a rug and all that kind of stuff. But yeah, I'm pretty pleased with how that all turned out. Oh, nice. You're getting to know Charlie. Anyways, what were we, we were doing skills. I got all sidetracked with my build. Um, charisma skill. Okay, so, Griselda. I mean, Eva, you can come over here and practice your speech. Emerson, what are you doing? You're playing violin. Well, why don't you come over to your house and watch some TV? No, actually, do your homework. Oh, and you've got a you've got a um, project to do. Uh, Griselda, you're asleep in Eva's bed. You don't sleep there. Didn't I get you to claim this bed over here? Go to sleep over here. Okay. Um, oh, this is going to be tricky. Okay. <laughs> oh, is that a male? Oh, this is a dance floor. Oh, your picture. Look. Put your picture up on the wall. It's not going to go on that wall. Put it on this wall. Um, and your trophies. And Curtis's books. And you don't need your TV. Okay. I think that's all good. Right. Now I'm aware that I could lock the door and everything, but um, that would mean visitors wouldn't be able to visit. You're working on your speech. Didn't I tell you to go to sleep? Is there a reason you can't go here? Go here? You, oh, you're stuck. 
I should get going. Thanks for letting me hang out. No worries, Charlie, anytime. <laughs> go to sleep. Okay, so she can go to sleep. Emerson's going to sleep. I should just turn the lights to auto, auto lights, this room. Oh, look, George has come to visit. Hello, George. Auto lights, this room. Maybe I'll auto lights this room too. I don't usually like auto lighting bathrooms, but Right, auto lights. Okay, now she's busy working on her skill, which is fantastic. And she's charisma level three. Um, I think we might get her to stop that and take care of her needs. Hunger, okay. Can you, um, cook some mac and cheese? Hey, I wonder if we do meals, whether they appear in the other fridge. Oh no! Sorry, that was my timer. That was louder than I needed it to be. Are you going to eat that? Good. Oh, I should probably buy a thermostat. Who's over here? Oh, Crystal. Hello, Crystal. While I'm thinking of it, because I will forget, I'll just move this chessboard. Now I can't remember where I had it. I think it was here. No, that can't be right. It's in the way. Where did I have it? Oh. I can't remember where it was. I think it was here. That must be it. No, because that was there. Maybe I'll just put it here behind the sofa. Maybe I'll delete it altogether. We don't really need it. Oh, no, we do need a chess table because we need the logic skill. Um. I think this was more here. Yeah, yeah, that's how it was. Sorry, Crystal. That's how it was. Good, okay. <clears throat> that's right, because when copy pasting, I had to copy paste a whole room and I had to make a division. Okay. I think we're set. You just need to go to sleep. And we can end this episode. Where is Ahana? We need her to go to sleep. Where is Ahana's bed? Where is Ahana's bed frame? Where is Ahana? There she is. Uh, butler, assign task, go to sleep. Okay. Oh, and we got George. We've got the ghosts running around. Okay, it's good. They can all come out. Just want to make sure that Ahana can go to sleep. Good. Okay. Curtis. Is fine. All right. Okay. So 
please leave your feedback, comments and suggestions down below. Hit that like button. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye.